with Christmas getting closer, you're probably pretty busy. You're likely getting ready for a company to show up, or maybe you're getting ready to go see people. Uh, maybe you're doing last minute shopping and wrapping and all that kind of stuff, which reminds me I ought to start that sometime soon, I guess. But in the midst of your busyness and all the other things you're thinking about, can I get you to stop just for a few seconds and think about what's coming this Sunday morning? In Bible study, we're going to talk about being children of God. John has a lot to say about what that actually means and the benefits of being God's children and the responsibilities of that and how wonderful it is. And so I'd really encourage you to go ahead and just read what he has to say so that you can come and share your thoughts about it. There's just lots to talk about in this section. So if you'd like to read ahead, the section is 1 John chapter 2, verse 28 through th chapter 3, verse 10. Lots to talk about. Bring your thoughts. Share together. We can teach one another. That'll be really good. Then in the sermon, we're going to talk about forgiveness. I've been piling up lots of ideas and lots of scriptures about forgiveness lately. And um, the more I think about it, the more I think we think we know how to forgive, but I don't think we actually do. Or we don't do it very often. In fact, when we think we've actually forgiven something, we've done something else completely. I don't know that we actually know how to do it. Fortunately, God has been trying to teach his people about forgiveness for a long, long time. And so we're going to go back to the Old Testament and get one example there. We're going to come up to the New Testament and get another example there. And by the end of the day, hopefully we're going to understand something about forgiveness. And then we're going to challenge each other to go and live kind and forgiving lives. Now we're going to see what God has to tell us. The sermon is called... Uh, stop burying the past. What real forgiveness looks like. I've been mentioning holidays and stuff, so let me just tell you this as well, that typically I don't like saving holidays till the end of the year. I like taking holidays in the summertime when it's nice and warm and you get out and do something, not like minus 22 today. But the way it worked out, I've got two weeks of holidays left that I've got to use before the end of the year. So, I just want to let you know that next week I'll be in the office Monday and Tuesday, and then I will be gone until January 10th. So if you need anything after Tuesday of next week, uh, please contact one of the elders or one of the deacons. Um, and also just note too that uh, even though I'm starting holidays next week, I will be around for Boxing Day. Justin Mooney and I are looking after the Boxing Day service. And I'll remind you, too, that that's going to start at 11 a.m. We won't have Bible study that day. We'll talk about all those details. We'll remind you about it again. They'll be in the bulletin. We'll make sure you know what's happening. But, uh, but we'll share all that on Sunday morning. Hope to see you there.